If you search up super dimensions on Google, there's going to be no defined or official definition there. Because super dimensions has no defined meaning in English. Instead, a derivative is from Japanese kanji or chojigen. Now, there's a lot of contentions with this and what it means and power scaling wise or just what it translates to in general. And if we use the infamous translator Google Translate and put chojigen in it, you get ultra dimensional. Only if you specifically write out super dimensional, hyper dimensional, or trans dimensional in the English to Japanese section, you get different results for what chojigen means. Even in other translators, we have similar results. Now something almost all of these have in common is that the terms that you get almost always come out to be higher dimensional in some aspect, with the one exception of transdimensional, which refers to a space of those other than the normal three-dimensional world, and it's something similar to a subspace. With higher dimensional being one of the more blatant translations, but with the other ultra, hyper, or super, the kanji of those words mean the same thing, that being cho. While super or ultra dimensions don't have a definitive definition in English, but hyperspaces do and they are defined as higher dimensional spaces or structures. Now without the use of these iffy online translators, let's actually translate the kanji. As we've already established, cho means super, ultra, hyper, as well as transcend, with the other following two kanji, jigen, which just means dimension. So now we find out that cho jigen either means transcendent dimension, super dimension, hyper dimension, or ultra dimension. And it cannot mean trans dimensional, as the kanji for trans, or tozetsu, is not found at all in either translations for the kanji. And quickly, for those who try to say super dimensions are beyond all dimensionality, they claim that due to the characters used in dimension being tutsugi, says order or sequence, and since cho can mean transcend, they say super dimensions transcend the order of dimensions. This is not only not supported in any established branch in mathematics or physics, as well as it falls under a fallacy of composition, as they are taking the word out of context as the combination of tutsugi and gen means dimension, not separately. So going with this logic, you would be just saying that it transcends order, which has nothing to do with dimensionality. And for those who try to say it's beyond the concept of dimensionality, we've already established and explained what it actually means, and has nothing to do with the concept of dimensionality. So the conclusion I came up with is that something that is hyper or super dimensional is in reference to higher or extra dimensional spaces or structures. And lastly, thanks to the rogue guy, he's very experienced in reading, speaking, and translating Japanese kanji, and he helped me understand and better my arguments. And please go subscribe to his channel, he posts his amazing content, we'll be uploading more this upcoming month, and we may have something cooking up in the near future.